Testing, testing, testing. Go. Hey everyone, it's that math magician. And on this video, let's take another look at how we can isolate a variable in a given equation. And let's go ahead and look at the equation two times the quantity y minus three equals four. And let's say that for this equation here, we want to solve or isolate for y. So that means we wanna get y by itself. So first thing that I always do when I'm dealing with isolating a variable, is I always rewrite the equation and I write the variable that I want by itself in another color so I can see how I'm gonna get it by itself. Now, looking at this equation here, I see that two is multiplying this quantity in parentheses. So unfortunately, I know some students might wanna jump and try to add three to both sides, but since that negative three is trapped inside those parentheses, we actually can't go to that step first. Instead, we need to divide both sides by two so that we can get rid of this two in the front. And by doing that, those twos cancel to a one, and now I'm just left with that quantity, y minus three, by itself, but it no longer has the parentheses around it. Now four divided by two creates two, and now for this final step, we can add three to both sides. By doing that, the threes on the left cancel, and I'm just left with y equals two plus three, which is five. This is an example of isolating a variable where there is no other variable in the answer, so you end up just having y equal a number. All right, guys, it's That Math Magician, and I'll see you on the next video.